Okay, speaking of nothing going on, the, the premise that caused the buckaroos to be in the building that night, they're running the show again. Tony Khan is off somewhere in Jacksonville, we, we presume, assume, whatever. And they've got a bunch of indie security guys, and they're doing a whiny promo. They're passing out Darby Allen's picture. He has been barred from the arena. He's not allowed in, and I don't let this guy in. And then Sanjay Dutt walked in and told them, in, uh, and again, this is the uh, Sanjay doing the, the comedy. It's comedy on top of comedy. This was hat on a hat. You've got comedy figures in the Buckaroos and a comedy figure in Sanjay. And together they do the comedy about Zippy the Giant Pinhead in the main event tonight taking care of Brian Danielson. <sighs> but then we went back out to the, unless you have anything to add to this, uh, that that's, that was the setting up the premise. We'll see the buckaroos again. Yeah. They're doing themselves no favors and having Sanjay show up to not say, Oh boy, this is going to be something good. Why would you, why can't they even act? Let me try. There's so multiple act like a gentleman is not like acting and actors. Let me try to phrase that. Why can they not perform like they are serious at what they are doing, which would still be acting, but it wouldn't be acting badly on purpose. See, this makes your head hurt. Why are they doing this where you, specifically don't believe they mean anything they say and they are not trying to take it seriously because they can't and they're not talented enough to do that to actually do a work that works <sighs> i'll say this too and i've always in the past said good things or had compliments at times about nick jackson for his athleticism he as a scumbag lackey heel <clears throat> there's something there the problem is his brother has go away heat with more people than they realize because Nick Jackson can hide the bad acting because he's a dimwit and he comes across as a dimwit. The other one is clearly the leader of the two and he's the worst actor. He's the one with the bad stutter. He's the one who goes out there and hams it up for the camera. The fans don't give a shit anymore. So I just want to say that because I do think that's an important thing. The Bucks don't have any heat, but specifically one of the Bucks I think has a lot of go away heat with a lot of the audience. And the other one would make a good slimy flunky. Yeah, he'd be a really Back good up. slimy flunky. You're, you're trying to cause some trouble. You call out your men. He comes out there, looks like a dirt bag, takes a few good bumps. You don't because you sent your flunkies out there. I think he would work yeah. like that. I got no problem with that. See, now that's an example of being used as you really appear rather than as you delude yourself to believe you are. <laughs> 